John Michael Obi gave over a decade of service to the club he joined as a fresh-faced 19-year-old, during which time he won every major honor, as well as an Africa Cup of Nations and a bronze medal at the Rio Olympics with Nigeria. He was renowned for saving his best performances for the big occasion, and his highlight in a Chelsea shirt came on our greatest night of all, the 2012 Champions League final, when he produced a masterful midfield display. He had been outstanding in both legs of the epic semi-final victory over Barcelona, too. A strong, powerful midfielder with excellent positional sense and a sure touch, Mikel was a consistent presence in our team during his time in West London. He left in 2017 having won the Premier League twice, the FA Cup four times, the League Cup twice, and the Champions League and Europa League, too. His value to the team was always keenly felt by those who managed him and played alongside him during his 372 appearances for the Blues, and that figure puts him in the very top bracket of foreign players to have represented Chelsea. At the time of his departure, only Petrasek, Didier Drogba and Bronislav Ivanovic had made more. Mikel represented the Nigeria under-20 team at the 2005 FIFA World Youth Championship and won the silver ball for the second best player at the tournament, behind Lionel Messi, as the Africans finished runner-up to Argentina. He made his debut for the Nigeria senior team on August 17, 2005, when he came on as a second-half substitute in a 1-0 friendly win over Libya. He did not play for the national team again prior to being named in the squad for the 2006 Africa Cup of Nations. In Nigeria's first group game, against Ghana, Mikel was an unused substitute. However, he was introduced into the second game against Zimbabwe early in the second half. Within 10 minutes of coming on, he had supplied both the corner that resulted in Christian Abado heading the game's opening goal, and scored Nigeria's second goal. He made his first international start in Nigeria's final group game, a 2-1 victory over Senegal. In 2007, Mikel was suspended from all Nigerian national teams after manager Bertie Vots dropped him from the squad for the Africa Cup of Nations qualifier against Niger for failing to attend their previous match against Uganda. Mikel cited an injury, but because he did not attend an independent check by Nigerian officials, he was dropped. This, and his refusal to play for the Nigerian under-23 side, resulted in his suspension by the Nigeria Football Federation. After apologizing, he was called up to the national squad for the 2008 Africa Cup of Nations in Ghana. At the tournament, he scored one goal and registered one assist in a match against Benin to help Nigeria qualify for the quarterfinals against hosts Ghana, where they lost 2-1 to their West African rivals. Mikel had been called up for the under-23 side in preparation of the team's last Olympic qualifier on March 26, 2008, needing a win to qualify. His failure to show up for any of the qualifiers again setting off some controversy with the U-23 team coach Samson Siazia, who dropped him from the Olympic squad amidst significant furor from the media. On June 5, 2010, Mikel was ruled out of the 2010 FIFA World Cup in South Africa due to injury. He had been struggling to recover from a knee problem after undergoing surgery in May, though there were also reports that an ankle injury was to blame for Mikel's withdrawal. At the 2013 Africa Cup of Nations, Mikel was a key player for Nigeria as they went on to win their third continental title. He was named by the Confederation of African Football, CAF, in the team of the tournament alongside teammates Vincent Inaima, F. Ambrose, Victor Moses, and Emmanuel Emenich. Mikel made his FIFA World Cup debut at the 2014 tournament in Brazil, earning a Man of the Match award in the Super Eagles opening game against Iran. He helped the team to reach the knockout stage for the first time since 1998. He was selected by Nigeria for their 35-man provisional squad for the 2016 Summer Olympics and was later named captain of the Olympics squad. On August 13, 2016, Mikel scored his first-ever Olympic goal in a 2-0 win against Denmark to advance to the semi-final. After the 2-0 defeat to Germany, Nigeria went on to the bronze medal match against Honduras.
On August 20, Mikel helped Nigeria to the bronze medal in a 3-2 victory over Honduras. Nigeria became the first ever country to win all three medals at the Olympic Games with the 1996 squad winning the gold and 2008 squad winning the silver. In a 2018 FIFA World Cup qualification match against Algeria, Mikel scored a goal and assisted his Chelsea teammate Victor Moses in a 3-1 victory. In July 2019, Mikel said that the 2019 Africa Cup of Nations would be his last tournament for Nigeria. He retired at the end of the competition, in which Nigeria came third. During preparations for the 2003 FIFA U-17 World Championship, the Nigerian Football Association NFA, mistakenly submitted Michael as Mikel for the tournament in Finland. He decided to keep the new name, saying that it had a special ring to it. He was most commonly referred to as John O.B. Mikel upon his arrival at Chelsea, but on July 31, 2006, he stated that he prefers to be called Mikel John O.B. instead, and he officially changed his name to Mikel John O.B. in 2016. On June 18, 2021, the Nigerian Minister of Youth Sports Development, Sunday Akin Dare, announced the appointment of Obi as the country's youth ambassador. On August 12, 2011, Mikel's father, Michael Obi, was the victim of a suspected kidnapping in Nigeria. Mikel was informed before Chelsea's match against Stoke City two days later but opted to play despite his concerns for his father's well-being. On August 15, 2011, Mikel made an impassioned plea for his father's safe return. He told Sky Sports News, I've always tried to help the country, this is the time for the country to help me, whoever knows where my dad is should please contact me. Michael. Obi was found alive on August 22, 2011, in the Nigerian city of Kano. His abductors were reported to be in police custody. On June 26, 2018, a few hours before a World Cup match, Mikel was informed of another kidnapping of Michael Obi, but did not tell any of his team members. The Enugu State Police stated that they rescued Michael Obi on July 2 after a gunfight. His Honours At Chelsea Premier League, 2009-10, 2014-15 FA Cup 2006, 07, 2008, 09, 2009 to 10, 2011 to 12. Football League Cup, 2006, 07, 2014 to 15. FA Community Shield, 2009. UEFA Champions League, 2011 to 12. UEFA Europa League, 2012 to 13. With Nigeria. Africa Cup of Nations, 2013, third place, 2006, 2010, 2019. Nigeria Olympic. Summer Olympics bronze medalist, 2016. Individual. FIFA World Youth Championship Silver Ball, 2005. CAF Most Promising Talent of the Year, 2005. Chelsea Young Player of the Year, 2007-2008. CAF Team of the Year 2005-2013. Africa Cup of Nations Team of the Tournament, 2013. African Footballer of the Year Runner-Up, 2013. On November 4, 2016, it was announced that the club would not be renewing Mikel's contract when it expired at the end of the season. On January 6, 2017, Chinese club Tianjin TEDA signed Mikel on a free transfer. On April 14, 2018, he scored his second league goal for Tianjin, and first goal of the season against Guangzhou RNF. He left Tianjin TEDA at the end of the 2018 Chinese Super League season in November 2018. After two years in China, Mikel joined English Championship Team Middlesbrough on a short-term deal in the 2019 winter transfer window. The 31-year-old was a free agent after leaving Chinese side Tianjin TEDA.
Mikel made 19 appearances for Borough, scoring once against Rotherham United on May 5, 2019 as the team narrowly missed out on a playoff spot finishing 7th. He was released by Middlesbrough at the end of the 2018-19 season. In the summer of 2019, Mikel joined Trabzonspor on a two-year contract with the option of a further year. It was announced on March 17, 2020, that Mikel had left Trabzonspor by mutual consent, days after expressing his concerns about the Turkish Super League continuing amid the global coronavirus pandemic. Mikel signed a one-year contract with EFL Championship side Stoke City on August 17, 2020. He made his Stoke debut on September 13, 2020 in a 0-0 draw away at Millwall. Under Michael O'Neill, Mikel was a key member of the team in 2020-21, making 41 appearances as Stoke finished in a mid-table position of 14th. At the end of the season O'Neill stated that he wants Mikel to stay at Stoke for another year. On July 1, 2021, Mikel cancelled his contract agreement with Stoke and moved to Kuwait SC. On November 4, 2021, the contract with Kuwait SC was terminated after only four months of joining the team. On September 27, 2022, Mikel announced his retirement from professional football at the age of 35. Thank you for watching this video.